There we go. Greetings, everybody. BJ Weiler back with you for uh, day 77 of 100 days of gaming. Uh, let me do this. Uh, seems a little loud to me here. Of course, it could just be this here. But, uh, sound. Here we go. Oh, uh, yes, it's. Uh, There we go. Uh, this is going to be a really, uh, really short episode here um, for day 77. Lots, a lot of stuff going on in real life today. So, yeah. Um, so we'll just uh, putz around here for a few minutes again. Raising money for the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia. $285 in. First initial goal of $250 has been met and surpassed. Thank you everyone who uh, has donated. Uh, $15 away from our next goal here. 100%. Every single penny goes to the kids and goes to the hospital. Goes to the hospital to help the kids of the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia. Uh, you know, Extra Life is playing games and raising money. Uh, for the children's miracle network you know we play games uh to help support these hospitals all across north america over 170 hospitals in this network they need this money to really uh operate at the highest level possible to treat kids with cancer birth defects serious injuries serious illness all that stuff if i can get just one dollar just one dollar for each of these 100 days of gaming videos that's a hundred dollars right there uh, right in the bank, you know, just one person out there say, hey, I like that particular, I like day 77, I like SOTOR, I like day 77, I'm donating a dollar. That one dollar can really add up, that one dollar can really make a difference for the kids. So no donation is too large, no donation is too small. Every single penny, every single dollar is much appreciated here. So if you like what we're doing here, if you happen to like the game we're playing, Star Wars The Old Republic today, please consider uh, check out the links down below the description of this video here. Consider making a donation uh, safely, securely, and anonymously if you so desire on the Extra Life website, uh, my participant page, which you can make the donation. So it goes directly to the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia, again, down in the description below. And uh, you can be a real life hero uh, for kids uh, by uh, making that donation in the meantime let's uh get on with it here um okay we already have a way to cute module so good yes 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 because we hate speed leveling speed loving speed leveling uh completely stinks in this game but i figured um a lot of changes uh since i last played this game uh before 4.0 dropped two years ago it's, it's been pretty much two years since i've i've actually played the game uh, because primarily because of the speed leveling uh, that was made the norm for the game. It's just terrible, a terrible, terrible system. Um, uh, when it's forced upon you. So uh, let's see what we're going to do here. But it uh, looks like there's a lot of positive changes on the way. Uh, it sure doesn't matter really. Um, the game is now uh, under uh, new leadership, so to speak. Um, got a new lead, uh, as a lead designer, lead director, or whatever uh, Keith's uh, exact title is. Um, so it's uh, so it's looking looking positive. Uh, there's going to be a, another server merge, you might say. Servers are going to be condensed down into five whole new, brand new servers. Of course, I should have gone the other way. So, uh, coming, up, uh, coming up later this month and into November. So, we'll see how things go. So hopefully positive changes, and I, I have had um, uh, a discussion with Keith uh, through uh, personal email. Well, not personal email, but uh, you know, email through the forums. Uh, you know, private private messaging through the forums that uh, gives me hope that some of the 
Some of the more onerous changes uh, that were made with Full Point uh, were going to be uh, rolled back or um, uh, options provided to opt out of those changes, one of which is the speed leveling. Um, so, you know, it's all good stuff. So, figured we'll, we'll do a little bit of Star Wars The Old Republic this year because I, I, I have really missed playing the game. It was very, very enjoyable uh, prior to 4.0 landing. Um, and being implemented um, and it's, you know I never really wanted to stop subscribing never really wanted to stop playing the game but unfortunately um, with the enhanced XP and all that kind of stuff it just it just really didn't make the game fun um, fun in the slightest anymore so there's something I had to walk away from um, but again you know positive changes on the horizon here so uh, you know, I've always said it's like as long as I enjoy the game and the, the developers are making good decisions, I will um, support the game. So uh, I kind of like the decisions being made. It's kind of like the the upcoming uh, mergers that are finally happening, and um, we'll go from there and see what happens here. Uh, this is Fondry, which was from the Soviet character by the Empire and Dread Petri. Thankfully, the Brennan uh, hijacked the shell. Most clearly, they used to go to the Fondor system in the core worlds to rescue our friends in Prussia. Complete Fondor escort. Okay, so let's do it. That's a hell, still a hell of a lot of experience. I can't stand that. But, uh, for the purposes of. Of day 77 here. We're just going ahead and going to go do this space mission here. Fondor Escort, where are you at here? I think Fondor Escort is in here somewhere. Obviously, the galaxy map has changed quite a bit here. Fondor Escort, here we go. Make five creds, huh? Yes. There's definitely a lot of changes since I last played the game here. Especially to the galaxy map. So we'll go through Fondor Escort here and we'll call Day 77 in the bag. However brief, unfortunately, it is for the video anyway, but uh, we actually still have a lot of other stuff to get on. We just unfortunately can't stream. We're, uh, barrel roll. Shuttle located. Anymore. Moving to intercept. I always love doing these space, space missions. A lot of people derided them for being space on the rails and kind of stuff. But I always, I, I always kind of really enjoy the space missions. I'm fortunate that, uh, you know, they never really, the, the really only part of the game that never really received any sort of development. Forces 
is with us. Done it. I really should do is probably go through, go to, um, do the Esleys. Maybe I should do the Esleys too, huh? I don't know how long that's going to take now because it's like a tactical thing. I just, I don't know how much, I really don't have that kind of time. So we actually have to do Atlas Reactor tonight too. It's the new season, the holiday season. So I wanted to stream that today. Today would be my normal day to stream. Unfortunately, streaming is out, but I do want to at least try to get a video of Atlas Reactor going too. So, but unbelievable. 84 light sight points, huh? Mm. Oh boy, what a lovely, lovely. And that, that's with the white acute module, which inactivates the even super bonus points ridiculous Absolutely. we should be light four oh we're light four okay so we're almost light five which is what we're looking for here so our class mission Higher level missions there. Got world bosses in the target list. Under 43,000. Wow. Production of Starfire. Flashpoint, flashpoint. Um, I'm a fleet. Um, yeah, you know what? Let's. Um, Head back as the Esleys would be just out of curiosity, just to see what the leveling is for the Esleys now. Um, oh. oh, that's right. Uh, I forgot. I don't have to dock here. I'm thinking Star Trek Online here, where I actually have to go in the dock. I just leave the ship, <laughs> and that actually lands me at the fleet. These cinematics, uh, I don't know if they're they're new in the last two years, but I know they added some of these, some of the cinematics before I stopped playing. So I think that was part of that. So nice, nice little additions, though. You know, 
some people would say just a waste of time but you know I consider them nice little additions Cruise now. Knights of the Eternal Terribly Bad <sighs> Expansion. Alright, so, um... I remember how to get to... Gorsant Departures, Cartel Bazaar, Typhon... Those are the other flashpoints, I think. It's Gorsant Departures. Oh, there we go. Perfect. So we go this way. Uh -huh. It's been so long. Yes, maybe. Bomo gala apayang. Nilama imi amka amgap? Memgam gamgi. Nina gegwan. Am nerna hanak. Glad to hear it. That's excellent news. Mem ilik meraka. Nayanaram. Kam kalu amik manik. Manala yang perlu. Amka kalami naya kira nubua. Okay. So, ah, veteran mode, story mode. Okay, so let's do story mode. That'll be interesting. Just, just, I just want to see uh, some of the, uh, just some of the, the first, uh, see how the changes work here. I'm probably not going to, definitely don't, probably don't, definitely have enough time to get through the whole thing, but. Uh, for this episode, but uh, we'll give it a couple of minutes and see what happens here. Just to see what it's like. I guess I should do a new Wretched Hive recap episode. I haven't done one in uh, quite a while. Um catch up on things in the wretched hive of the forums too and discuss the game uh, changes coming up in general and all that fun stuff Is this the Bach table still? Yep, still not accepting players at this time. Let's see here. Oh, I should have brought Cure along with me. Could have gotten some uh, more uh, favor me. here. Yes, could I speak with you for a moment? I don't mean to trouble you, Jedi, but I'm curious if anyone from the ship's crew has come to speak with you yet. 
Why do you ask? Why would the crew want to talk to passengers? Is something wrong? I heard a rumor that there's an Imperial warship following us. I know, I know, the Treaty of Coruscant. But I don't trust the Empire to keep the peace. It's good to stay vigilant. We should always be on our guard against the evils of the Sith. It's good to hear I'm not the only one concerned about the Imperials. The crew won't tell the passengers anything at all. It's not very reassuring. We have the right to the truth. If we're in danger, the crew has a responsibility to tell us. Exactly. At least then we could prepare in case of an attack. Warning, Speaking warning. of which... Incoming fire! All hands, brace for incoming! Repeat, all hands! Can you hear me? Are you all right? Don't worry about me. Good, good. That was quite a hit. We're lucky not to be hurt. Listen, you have to get to the bridge. The captain will need all of the help he can get right now. Go, hurry. Oh, let's yeah, just hope right. it's not too late to help. It's never too late to try. Good luck. Okay. Yeah. Alright. That was interesting. Anyway, thanks everybody. I've got to run. DJ Working. Till next time. I'll see you again.